Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. Hope you are having a great day. So I had an order come in from Instacart and then I also went to this local farmer where I get like my jams and different fruits and vegetable. But pretty much what I'm going to be doing is prepping everything and also organizing so you guys will get to see the fridge and the pantry. So just start taking them off one by one. And putting them in this? Yeah, this one here. So I decided to go ahead and speed this part up. I'm not really sure how you do things in your house, but definitely at my house, what I like to do is take all the grapes off the stem, cut up all of my strawberries and everything like that. That way, all the kids have to do is open the fridge, grab and go. That has really worked for me. I find that doing that, the fruits and also the vegetables, they just get eaten a lot faster. But because we are, you know, kind of still under quarantine, they pick and choose what they want right now. So every week it just changes. So what I do is I just interchange what I give to them in terms of the fruit and vegetable. That way I can kind of, um, that way I can keep the food menu fresh. A million people in the crowd, but I only see your face in all the lights. I have a new jar of monkey butter. And then I also have the orange marmalade. And then I have frog jam. As the bass keep pounding on me, baby, I really want to make you mine. I don't really care about love. I don't really care about happy ever after. Something about you gives me hope. Something about you, yeah. guys here's a quick look into my fridge it's quite empty but it's full I haven't been buying um, I haven't been buying as many fresh vegetables simply because of the COVID but now they're trying to let people out and open up some businesses so I don't know how that's going to change but let me just show you guys really quickly down here I have the fruits that I cut up in here I have the Sargento which are like the little breakfast snacks that I like and then I have some cheese in here. And then these are just some orange juice, some ginger, apple cider shots right there. I have orange juice and different things. I actually did not know that we had a Whole Foods, so I ended up going to Whole Foods. I have some oranges, some um, cantaloupe and pineapple in the back. And then up here I have the eggs and my essential water which I have some in the door also. These are smaller, that way the kids can just kind of grab them and go. But this is pretty much the fridge for now. Again, I'm missing a lot of vegetable. That is because most of my veggies right now are frozen. And then on this side of the door, on this side of the door, I have my lemonade, I have my coffee, and then down here, I just have um, my cream cheese and also the garlic. I'm going to go ahead and clean the kitchen now. All right, you guys, it's getting real. <laughs> so because I am putting the uh, pantry transformation on hold, I'm going to say for seven or eight months. 
I decided to go ahead and clean and organize everything, which means taking everything out of the box, taking everything out of bags and stuff. I already started. I have a new uh, Nutribullet. I'm going to, I think I'm going to leave that in the box, but I'm going to move it over. And then I have, um, I actually have a plug. Let me show you guys. Plug back here, which I don't leave the toaster plugged in just because I don't want a fire or anything like that. And then I have the plug here. So when the pantry gets done, the microwave is going to go there and you're not going to see it. Then there's going to be backsplash and then cabinet. So I'm going to pretty much lose this part here. I think I'm still going to do like maybe, um, I'm still going to do something. Let me just show you guys because what I'm thinking about doing is getting something for the door and that way that will be situated but it's only going to be that space there and it's um down here is the tile the sub well it's subway tile but i'm going to do the herringbone design also inside of the pantry but i decided to go ahead and clean it and it actually looks really good it was really irritating me every time i would open the door and it'd be so chaotic but i knew because i was going to change it i was like whatever but now that i'm putting it on hold i went ahead and Try to get it organized. I'm excited. Something about you, yeah. When the sun goes down and the night skies fall in, do you believe in one time lovers? Cause deep inside of my wildest dreams, you'll be by my side. When the sun goes Alright you guys, this is pretty much it. I don't want to spend any money and I don't even want to do a partnership where I would get a whole bunch of containers and a lot of things because I'm not even 100% sure if I'm going to be able to keep these guys here. Because of the new configuration of how the cabinets are going to be, I don't have exact specs of everything like how much space is going to be left in the middle, how big each unit is. I don't have those things. So when it comes, I'll have a better idea. But... I know that these guys can fit in this cabinet over the fridge. So that's the only reason why I'm going to leave them right there. But I don't want to purchase anything else because everything is going to be in like cabinets and drawers and things like that. And like I said, I am going to condense. It's not the perfect looking thing in the world, but it's definitely a lot better organized. It was a hot mess before, but for right now, this is how it's going to look. It actually looks a lot better. All right, you guys, let's go outside real quick. Let's get some air. Ooh, my grass is so green, y'all. I um turned on my sprinkler system and I didn't let the guy, the guy, um, the guy. Hopefully, you guys can hear me. The guy, he had his blade pretty like low, and I asked him to bring it up a little bit more so he doesn't like. I don't know what it's called, but watering it and stuff. It's so green. You can bark, honey, as long as you don't bring your little chihuahua stuff over here. We good. Although today was a pretty random, like, I guess, cleaning day, I wanted to share with you a brief update. So this is the fixture that is in the master bathroom. I really wasn't in love with it from the moment I seen it. I really wanted to change something else. 
but it was going to be extremely costly to change it so what i did is i went to home depot and i found something a little bit bigger and this is the new hardware i really like it i didn't know how i was going to feel about the chrome because i'm really not into chrome like that i don't like like super shiny things but um this one is actually not bad i love how the water comes out i've had different faucets in the past so i really wasn't like super stuck on exactly the type a fixture that I wanted I just knew I didn't want the one that was there well you guys that is pretty much it for today's video I really hope that you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys next time bye